Hello everybody and welcome to Plume Lumière Tarot. I hope you're doing very good and here's the reading today for the month of February for the sign of Libra. So Libra or Ascendant Libra, this is for you. The first two cards that came out for you, first of all, um, well the energy card came out to be the Archangel, okay, Archangel Ariel that rules the second chakra and the, the card of uh, Akashic card that came out is the chess game upside down I'm gonna show you on the screen the um, upright and downright position for that card so you can uh, take a look at, for yourself and see um, I'm gonna talk to you about the chess game first like okay so it's um it's an important very important card right now and i know that this is there's something going on here um first of all the chess game in the reverse position um it could be some political aspect at work or colleague or you know like association wherever you're giving your time there is some political um, situation that is actually getting pretty nasty and um, it could be like a lot of conflict there's some people that don't want to bend to any rules and there you are in the middle of all that the, the way things are going right now it's not going to change it's not going to get better so don't don't put yourself into a situation a, a, a way of thinking that it's gonna it's gonna resolve anytime soon it's not so a lot of people some people right now are losing their job some people right now are just like changing position it just like it it's it just like exactly on a chessboard okay and everyone is thinking only to themselves for themselves their own little needs so you are right in the middle of all that so what do you do so there is a few options for you of course you can stay and you know live in that this situation or you can simply leave okay if there's nothing else for you in there leave don't stay <laughs> you know you have sometimes to take away the old stuff to be able to enter new stuff okay like say like i say you can go to a store and find like five kitchen sets that are beautiful even if you buy them all you're gonna have to eliminate some put some out to make some room to make some room for something new and something that suits you better okay so this is uh, what you have and um think of it Think of it um, in, in a positive way, you know, when you see something like a card that comes like this. Think of it of, in a positive way. Because, you know, sometimes we stay in a position because we're thinking, well, things are going to get better. It cannot get worse. Oh, and then when it gets worse, then we're there thinking, well, what am I going to do? Am I going to stay? <laughs> why do, you know, why is it moving so much? There, is some, there are just some toxic environment sometimes that you are caught into and you still have something you can do about it you see okay so think for yourself now a nice card that came out here i'm going to show you like this it's a session second chakra and um of course this chakra is a chakra of creativity and sexuality um in this aspect this card is telling you to be more confident to trust yourself maybe to be more adventurous in this way to try to explore you know that that person that is very meaningful to you that's that person that is close to you maybe there's going to be a, a right time for you right now to try to of course it's valentine month of valentine so maybe you try to you can try to get a little closer move a little closer allow yourself to be creative allow yourself to be to be, to be the explorer to put 
in your um, in your way of behavior acting the other make the other person confident in the way you feel and the way he makes or she makes you feel so it's time for you to open up it's time for you to let go of old situation the old you that was just like so like afraid to uh, let go or just a little not comfortable with your own body your own sexuality whatever it is try to allow yourself to be more confident in that part so this is what i have for you in the month of february so let's move now to the big picture what i'm having right here let's concentrate now to those three cards that i find in the middle you have the six of cups the eight of cups and the four i have a feeling that um first of all just meaning the hardcore of those meaning the six of cups is always a situation where you are into living into a past situation or something from the past coming back or just like something from the past it could be infancy it could be like old days that are just like you know very are very all of a sudden very present to your heart so you have like that six of cup there you have the eight of cups that says that you are going toward a more meaningful um not as superficial uh things you're going for something that's really really matters to you so is it because some of you are doing some kind of house cleaning housekeeping into your old memories it could be a bunch of picture it could be a bunch of documents you just need to release and let go of some things you know make a kind of a selection of those things that are important to you but really important to you not for peter john and, and and alice it's just for you what is important and i think this is going to be a very valuable experience for you to do so this fool here is telling you know it's, you're going to take the freedom to finally do it for yourself. You're going to have to take that, that ability, that, that potential, a possibility for you to just do it and, and be happy and proud of what you did, you know. So it's nice sometimes to travel with a little lighter luggage. So that means there's some old stuff that needs to go. And you're going to be able, this month of February, you're going to be able to let go. You have to think with this card here is that we are spiritual being experimenting some human life and human um, emotions okay so i encourage you to just move forward with this particular aspect where, where you find yourself right now to just like dig deep inside and see what you can release and what you can let go this is a, a very meaningful and very positive thing to do at the base at the base you will find the six of wand in the past the knight of coin not the knight of pentacles in the present you have the page of one uh, the page of, of pentacles and you have the ten of one right in the future future so at the base right now most of you have been working very hard into um preparing yourself doing something right now and you have the, you know you have manifested a lot lot of efforts and actually you can be proud of what you have accomplished and the thing is that a lot of people don't know but that implies that you did put a lot of effort so this is to be considered it's it probably seems easy for a lot of people but for you you know how much has been um it's been difficult and you've been doing it and now you can just like tap yourself in the back and say well good job baby so what i have here right behind you this knight of um pentacles signifies what he says to you is that you are trying too much to have everything done too fast and you don't see the progress you're 
I've been, you've been working so hard to do everything. You know, it could be like the last, the last 10 days even. You've been working hard, like just like someone that chases his own tail. The thing is that what you're looking for is not something that needs to be done now or tomorrow. It's something that's further down and you still have time. So if you get yourself ready so fast and you still have to, to wait for the date, then you're putting too much pressure on yourself, you know? So don't, don't try to be so, um, no, don't try to be this, this pushy on this, you know? You take the time to rest. Actually, in the present time, this is what you have again. You have that little page of pentacles. This page of pentacles is telling you, you have to see, you have to notice. Right now, you can see a lot of those progress that you've been doing. You have to be able to sit down and look carefully and say, Yes, I can really see now what is going on. I can really see you're not over your head anymore. You see, you're more, a lot more easiest position. So you're okay with it, with this one. The card that just on the tip of your nose, that could be in the next few weeks, but it could be like a little further down. You have the Ten of Pentacles that tells you that in a ne near future, you're going to have some kind of financial security, financial abundance. It could be a heritage. It could be just like the selling of something that major and things are going to just go in the right path, right direction. Everything's going to be just fine. And especially it is true because when I look at the card that crown your, um, your reading for today is the 19, the sun. And of course, when I have this for your future, immediate future, I have this for your long-term future, then I'm having some kind of big success, major, major success, and it's money success. Now, let's see, where you're going to find yourself? The Hierophant is like the Pope. Okay, this is where you're going to find yourself. You know that what it is that you're doing right now, the things you're preparing right now, you're doing, you're very by the book, you respect the rules, you do the right thing. So, you are confident. Right now, you are confident on those things you're doing. The perception people are having when they look at you, they see that nice queen of one, very energetic being, a person that's very energetic, very creative, um, someone that is putting her heart to things, those things that she does. She is, <clears throat> she is brilliant, but valiant also. She's a hard worker. For some of you, like if I go back to this card here, I was telling you, like, you know, the second chakra, and I have this card here. For those of you that are re already in um, a situation where you are together with a person that is important to you. Um, actually, your biggest fear, biggest hope is that you're going to get this type of, um, the intimacy is going to be, it's going to come back to help you feel love, give love, receive, you know, and it's right there. So this is one of your biggest hope right now. Of course, it's going to be a Valentine's um, month. So I hope everything works wonderful for you. But this card over here with this um, two of cups is the, the number one card for couples. If you are single and you're watching this, this could be what you're looking forward very much. Okay, so if this represents your biggest fear, but also your biggest dream. You want to have that significant person and you have everything in store right now to go to that direction. So, you know, be patient. The right person is going to come along. The last card of your reading, the one that crowns your reading is the sun. So, the sun signify the heat, the light, the energy, the children, 
the, the you know the life you want for yourself signifies goals signifies success signifies being into the spotlight but in the in the right way the positive way so here it is so you have all hopes are permits libra everything should work wonders for you this month the last four cards that i see um i'm gonna name it you have um i'm gonna name them sorry they have the seven of pentacles you have the major arcanum the star you have the uh, knights of sword and you have the two of coins seven of pentacles is make sure that you're gonna well actually you're gonna you're gonna pick up what you sow okay you're gonna have to receive the a just fair return for what you did work for okay so it's gonna come to you and the thing though is what I see and I was telling you a little earlier with the card of the star it seems to me that that direction you're taking is going to lead you to something that's going to be very closest to your dream but this is not something that's going to start in February and finish in February it's something that could be further down the road sometimes it could be take even one year but sometimes it could be just a few months ahead okay the Knight of Sword that is there is telling me that you have a tendency sometimes to probably be in a hurry to see things happening. It's probably this is why you, you're just working so hard right now to put yourself a little bit in advance of everything. But here, this night here is you have to take care of this guy because this person puts you into a situation where you want to decide fast, sometimes too fast. So make sure you make you pay attention here. And here the second of cup is just like you're gonna probably be balancing between two situations. Could be two work opportunity, two new house, two new uh, partners. You're gonna be in a hurry to pick something. And why are you so so much in a rush you know try to calm down and make sure you do the right thing the last two cards i picked for you what i call my candy cards um i was telling you earlier about um that oh, the fool here that says we are spiritual being living a human condition woman a human experience and here it comes again you have the card of spirituality and intuition these two are linked a tiny little thread in the between those two cards uh, together it seems to me like you very well know you're very aware aware you are aware there's something there's somebody up there taking care of you. There's somebody taking care of you. And you're going to, if you practice any kind of, of um, concentration, meditation, yoga, whatever it is, it's going to put you into a position where you're going to be able to pinpoint your, um, your, contact with, your contact with your upper self. Okay, so do not hesitate if you have time and if you can try to make time for this. It is. We're not just empty shell that work, that walk on the face of the earth and who's going to finish everything after or, or time is done. I think there's really more, something more. And here you have the card that bring you to, to get back to that essence, okay? So this was the reading that I had for you, Libra. I hope you enjoyed the reading. I'm going to have to do some editing <laughs> this one. So I... Wish you enjoy. I expect I would love to see your comments, and of course, I like to see you to subscribe to Plume Lumière Tarot. So talk to you soon. Take care, everyone.